After defeating cursed spirit of the Wolf Queen, I recovered a lot of forbidden knowledge in her books. I definitely needed some time to analyze everything. So I traveled back to college and... Huh, it was so good idea I convinced Tovdir to become an Archmage. I would never succeed in doing all this organization work and caring about Wind Hat students. I spent dozens of hours reading Potemus books. At some point I realized that I was actually lucky that in these catacombs I met only her weakened soul. Even just reading these notes made it clear her power of necromancy was beyond my imagination. But now, this is the best source of knowledge I can only dream about. I learned a lot. Dark rituals I never heard of before and magical techniques to make bond between necromancer and his puppets even more stronger. After hundreds of failed attempts, I finally succeeded in summoning deadly creatures from planes of oblivion, but this was not the end. I discovered an ancient spells that allowed mage to spread his magical energy even more on his servants. With this, I realized I can empower my minions by protective spells and even recovering their damages straight during the battle. I gave them part of my life force, protecting them from damage, but receiving magical energy of oblivion in return. This was… this was a complete new level of summoning magic. It cost me a lot, but great power comes only with a high price. And I know that this is only a beginning. Meanwhile. Fighting those vampires in solitude catacombs made me realize that he is actually a vampire menace. I don't care about menace to people, but if this vampire infection will spread all across Skyrim, it will interfere with my own ambitions. And that should be an instrument, not a rulers of the living world. And so I decided to come and speak to these Dunguards as they seems to be only who understands the threat. So here is the Dayspring Canyon. Dungard headquarters must be nearby. Hmm. It seems they already organized some defense. Not bad. You're asking for trouble walking around with dangerous magic like that. You're asking for trouble walking around with dangerous magic like that. Well, maybe it is an unofficial Dungard greeting. I heard what's going on. The vampires, the dawn dog, all of it. I wanted to help, so here I am. Hmm. They even already built some watchtowers. You're pretty good set to fight, huh? Need something? No, thank you. I'm just looking around. Hmm. Even a recruit training. Not bad. Not bad. Friend, what are you doing here? Get him! Well, safety system should be still improved. You're going to fight vampires, but did not notice a looter in your territory. <sighs>
everyone is making real trainings. Whoever is leader of this Dungard, he must be really hating vampires. Here to join the Dungard? Good. Isran will decide if you've got what it takes. Go on, he's right inside. Why are you here, Tolan? The Vigilance and I were finished with each other a long time ago. You know why I'm here. The Vigilance are under attack everywhere. The vampires are much more dangerous than we believe. And now you want to come right into safety with the Dawn Guard. Is that it? I remember Keeper Karsep telling me repeatedly that Fort Dawnguard is a crumbling ruin, not worth the expense and manpower to repair. And now that you've stirred up the vampires against you, you come begging for my protection. Isram, Karset is dead. The Hall of the Vigilance, everyone, they're all dead. You were right, we were wrong. Isn't that enough for you? Yes, well. I never wanted any of this to happen. I tried to warn all of you. I am sorry, you know. So who are you? What do you want? My name is Seren. I heard you're looking for some vampire hunters. You heard right. I'm glad word's finally starting to get around. But that means it won't be long before the vampires start to take notice as well. So, what me and my boys can do to help you? I need someone out in the field taking the fight to the damn vampires, while we're getting the fort back into shape. Tolan was telling me about some cave the Vigilants were poking around in, seemed to think it was related to these recent vampire attacks. Tolan, tell him about, what was it? Dim Hollow. Yes, that's it. Dim Hollow Crypt. Brother Adelbald was sure it held some long-lost vampire artifact of some kind. We didn't listen to him any more than we did Isram. He was at the hall when it was attacked. That's good enough for me. Go see what the vampires were looking for in this dim hollow crypt. With any luck, they'll still be there. Here, you should take a crossbow. Good for taking out those fiends before they get close. Feel free to poke around the fort and take what you need. There isn't much yet, but you're welcome to anything you can use. I'll meet you at Dim Hollow. It's the least I can do to avenge my fallen comrades. Tolan, I don't think that's a good idea. You vigilants were never trained. I know what you think of us. You think we're soft, that we're cowards. You think our deaths proved our weakness. Stendar granted you do not have to face the same test and be found wanting. I'm going to Dim Hollow Crypt. Perhaps I can be of some small assistance to you. You there, boy. Stop skulking in the shadows and step up here. What's your name? Uh, I'm, uh... My name is Agmir, sir. Do I look like a sir to you? I'm not a soldier. And you're not joining the army. Yes, sir. E Isran. Didn't I tell you to step forward? Hm. Farm boy, huh? What's your weapon? My weapon? I mostly just use my pa's axe. When wolves are attacking the ocean, I'm going to have to use my pa's axe. Brave vampire hunter. Stand up, reserve us. No way. I think we can make him come in. Take this one. Let's see. Good to see you. I look forward to our next meeting. I don't need this metal junk. Better to leave it here. Watch the move. Take some getting used to.
I'm starting to think I need to buy a house in Dawnstar. I'm guessing too often there. Isran found something for you to do, eh? You're fighting good. When you'll be back in oblivion, tell my heartly thanks to Marunas Dagon. How many hides I already have in my storage? Huh. <sighs> when I'll be back to solitude next time, I definitely need to find them an application. One bandit scum fighting another one. Haha, <laughs> what a pleasant show! I think I need to get around the mountain on the other side to get to that cave.
Isn't that... Isn't that Vigilance Headquarters? Ugh. Where bias have no mercy. Are you ready, boys? Vampires. Attack, boys. I leave them to you. Good work, good work. Oh, you killed this one. No one should call you weak. Even you were one against all of them. You defeated so many. Rest in peace, Vigilant.
Well, it is time to make you stronger, boys. Time to test that spell. Oh, don't worry, you will like it. I promise. Great, it is working.
Um, I'm not sure I'm confused. Are you trying to say me hello? Dinner? You brainless blood suckers! This dinner will end your miserable life! What an irony! Your dinner will give your right leg as dinner to his dog. Uh, oh, I don't have a dog. <clears throat> that place. It is strange, but beautiful. Mm. like a... Oh, so it is a blood artifact. That looks like a coffin. Whoa, what a... Let me help you get up. Where is... Who sent you here? Well, I'll push back my surprise and ask who were you expecting? I was expecting someone... like me, at least. Like you... a vampire, right? Vampire, yes. But... why you were locked away like this? That's... complicated. And I'm not totally sure if I can trust you. 
But if you want to know the whole story, help me get back to my family's home. <sighs> Why I'm sure I will regret this. Well, where do you need to go? My family used to live on an island to the west of Solitude. I would guess they still do. By the way, my name is Serana. Good to meet you. How long we are you locked here? Good question. Hard to say. I... I can't really tell. I feel like it was a long time. Who is Skyrim's High King? Well, that's actually a matter for debate, you know. Oh, wonderful. A war of succession. Good to know the world didn't get boring while I was gone. Who Long the story short, the Empire supports Elisif. But there are really many in Skyrim loyal to Ulfric. Empire? What... what Empire? Cyrodiil Empire, of course. Cyrodiil is the seat of an empire? I must have been gone longer than I thought. Definitely longer than we planned. Please, let's hurry. I need to get home so I can figure out what's happened. Well... wait a second. Isn't that an Elder Scroll? Yes, it is. And it's mine. But where did you get it? It's complicated. I can't really talk about it. I'm sorry. What? They just became alive! Get him! Get him, boys! Protect me! Oh, so you joined the fight too? Not so bad for such a beautiful like you.
Strike him, burn him, feel the call of Dark Mark, my servants, finish him! This again, please, no. Uh, no, 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 get out from my head. Uh, that language. Good. Finally, an exit. We can't proceed through that blizzard. We need to set calm for this night. Serana, you did not sleep at all, didn't you? Well, let's return you home. Hey, is that the castle you talked about? Um, this is the 
So, is that your home? One I can tell about your family for sure. You are not a poor one. <laughs> hey, so, before we go in there... Are you alright? I think so. And thanks for asking. I wanted to thank you for getting me this far. But after we get in there, I'm going to go my own way for a while. I think. I know your friends would probably want to kill everything in here. I'm hoping you can show some more control than that. Once we're inside, just keep quiet for a bit. Let me take the lead. As you say, but just to let you know, if for some reasons you do not want to stay here anymore, Five minutes for Dungard. How dare you trespass here? Wait, Serana? Is that truly you? I cannot believe my eyes. My lord, everyone! Serana has returned. I guess I'm expected. I can't believe it. My long lost daughter returns at last. Yeah. I trust this you place. It stinks. The first thing you ask me? Yes, I have a But yes, I was glad to see you, my daughter. Must I really say the words aloud? Ah, if only your traitor mother were here. I would let her watch this reunion before putting her head on a spike. Now tell me, who is this stranger you have brought into our hall? This is my savior, the one who freed me. For my daughter's safe return, you have my gratitude. Tell me, what is your name? I am Saren. And your name? I am Harkon, Lord of this court. By now, my daughter would have told you what we are. I don't really care who you are. Perhaps you should. I count some of the oldest and most powerful vampires in Skyrim among the members of my court. For centuries we lived here, far from the cares of the world. All that ended when my wife betrayed me and stole away that which I valued most. Well, it was a good lesson of history. But what happens now? You have done me a great service, and now you must be rewarded. There is but one gift I can give that is equal in value to the Elder Scroll and my daughter. I offer you my blood. Take it and you will walk as a lion among sheep. Men will tremble at your approach and you will never fear death again. And what if I refuse? Then you will be prey, like all mortals. I will spare your life this once, but you will be banished from this hall. Perhaps you still need convincing. Behold the power! This is the power that I offer. Now, make your choice. Well, I'm sorry, my pale friend, but I clearly see what is behind that gift you're offering me. You value your own daughter less than some piece of hundred years paper. You killed your own wife and imprisoned your daughter. Your power is strong, 
I don't deny it. But the thing is that I don't want to take it from you. So be it. You are prey, like all mortals. I banish you. Well, good news, at least I'm alive. <sighs> I need to talk to his runner. Hey, hey you, what's going on here? Oh, well, I see. should have known it was only a matter of time before they found us. It's the price we pay for openly recruiting. We'll have to step up our defenses. I don't suppose you have some good news for me. Well, I have two news. Bad and bad. Of course. Why did I suppose differently? Fine. Tell me what you know. The vampires were looking for a woman trapped in Dim Hollow. A woman? Trapped in there? That doesn't make any sense. Who is she? More importantly, where is she? Well, she's actually a vampire, and she's daughter of some powerful vampire lord, Harkon. And so you delivered her to them. Um, Isran, remember about two bad news. They also have an Elder Scroll. They what? And you didn't stop them? You didn't secure the scroll. Well, you know, there just was a castle full of vampires. I'm lucky I made it out alive. Right. So they have this woman and an Elder Scroll. By the Divines. This couldn't get much worse. This is more than you and I can handle. I suppose we have to do something with it, right? Well, of course we do. I'm old, not stupid. We're just going to need some help. If they're bold enough to attack us here, then this may be bigger than I thought. I have good men here, but... There are people I've met and worked with over the years. We need their skills, their talents, if we're going to survive this. If you can find them, we might have a chance. And where can I find them? Right to the point, aren't you? I like that. Not like those fools in the Order. We should keep it small. Too many people and we'll draw unwanted attention to ourselves. I think we'll want Serene Gerard. Breton girl, whip smart and good with tinkering. Fascination with the Dwemer. Weapons in particular. Last I knew, she was out in the Reach. Convinced she was about to find the biggest Dwarven ruins yet. Might need a little convincing, but she should. You'll also want to find Gunmar. Big brute of a Nord. 
hates vampires almost as much as I do. Got it into his head years back that his experience with animals would help. Trolls in particular, from what I hear. Last I knew, he was out scouring Skyrim for more beasts to tame. Bring the two of them back here, and we can get started on coming up with a plan. Well, I suppose I should go. But one more thing. What do you have against a vigilant? Isn't that obvious? They're soft. The lot of them. Totally unprepared for any real threat. And yet I was the one ridiculed for trying to be ready for anything. Too extreme, they called me. Well, that doesn't seem to have worked out in their favor now, has it? As you say, Keep your eyes open. Well, see you soon, I hope. What a picture. In Castle Dungard, horses ride you. That Harkon. He's looking absolutely ruthless. And Serana. I hope she's fine.